Okay, just tuning around on the telescopic whip. I'm in my lounge. You can see the telescopic is there. This is the ATS 20. Got a signal on 6 decimal 100. 49 meter band. Do you know what? I think the ATS 25 is a bit deaf on the telescopic. Let's just turn that off. I'll just go here and unmute the. Can't hear it. The screen generates some harsh, this little uh, TFT screen generates some harsh on the receiver. And I think that's the problem. I just moved again. Let's just come up there. Look at that when I touch the case of the receiver. So there's an issue there. That makes all the difference touching the case. Let's just move that. Let's go back to the uh, ATS-20. We'll take a little minute to boot up. ATS-20. Way more sensitive. Turn that off. Let's go back to the 25. Pretty much nothing there. Touch the case is coming in. Still not coming in as well as the ATS-20 is there. Put my hand on the case. Release my hand. It's pretty much gone. Let's just mute again. Let's go back to the little ATS-20. This is the, on the original firmware. 1.5. The encoder on this one works fine at the moment. And there we are. So the ATS-20 wins hands down at least on 49 meters. Exactly the same telescopic whip. They're side by side. They're in the same place. ATS-20 wins hands down on sensitivity. So that's a bit of a shame.